Hi Sagittarius, thank you all so much for joining me here. This is going to be your weekly reading for your general and love energy for the week. So let us see what is coming up for your general and love energies for the week. Sagittarius, so I will be using the Lenormand deck for your general energies and the Prince Tarot for your love situation. Sagittarius. What is coming up for your general energies for the week, Sagittarius? If you want to book a personal reading with me, all of the details are there in the description. If you want, um, if you want to talk to me, if you guys are going through a tough situation, please uh, make sure to contact me. And all of the details on where to contact me is there in the description. Okay, so let us just start off with the reading. What is coming up for your general energies for the week? Sagittarius, what is coming up for you, the general energies for the week? General energies for the week, what is coming up for your general energies for the week? Sagittarius, what is coming up? We have the pair. So this is a very brave card to get. Like a first card, but also the bravest card that you can get. So this is all about you trying to be powerful. You are like uh, very strong and you have all the health and the protection that you need from your physical reality or your spirit guides and angels. Okay. So I feel like uh, you are going to be financially very stable this week but make sure to um, write down what you eat every day because this card is whenever this card comes out this is what I see this is what I say it's like this is a card where you need to really concentrate on what you take inside because that can bring you problems like not very big problems maybe like a food poison or like a stomach ache so it can be minor issues but please make sure what you put inside you okay because you might not be taking enough um uh, what to say you might not be taking enough concentration on what you're taking inside but you should and uh, let us pick out a few more cards for you guys This is beautiful so this card is all about purity it's about the purity that you feel within yourself this can also mean a marriage a commitment twin flame soulmate connection so if you are in a relationship you have all of those signs and synchronicities uh, in this relationship especially you see a lot of angel numbers and stuff like that this is another confirmation that this is a twin flame relationship a soulmate connection okay let us pick out a few more cards for you guys okay so somebody is masking their feelings towards you or you're masking your feelings towards somebody and i feel like another person is just gone deep in depression so few of you who are watching this might be going through a very tough phase of your life you are very very depressed in your situation but I also feel like somebody is masking their feelings. There is depression here, masking of feelings, being sad, trying to cleanse yourself. So these are the energies that I get out of your reading. But let us uh, get more clarity with some tarot cards. So that these are just oracle cards. But let me get some clarity with some tarot cards. Angels, give me some clarity with the situation for my beautiful Sagittarius. What is going on in the situation? Why do we have the masking card? And why do we have 
the coffin card. Okay. So we have the hydrofin cape coming out in reverse. So somebody is not, um, somebody is mature from within, but they are not being as mature as how they should be. I also feel like this person knows that you are going to be there for them. That is why they are just sitting there viewing you. Okay. They know that this seeing you from a far distance, this person can be also spying on you. They are masking their feelings, they're spying on you. With a hermit card, I also feel like there are a lot of things this person has on their mind right now. Okay, about creating beautiful things for themselves. If you can see with this card, this person seeing the sky through the telescope. It's like this person being with you feels like they are seeing the sky full of stars so that is how this person feels when it comes to you and clarifying this card we have another box here with a fool card so this is all about this person's not thinking they are thinking a lot but they're not thinking and taking some kind of an action they're just like thinking something and going into it diving deep into it and being sad and depressed and all that so if they are going to think and then think on why they are behaving a certain way that they are then stuff everything is going to go perfectly that is what i can see here with these cards let us get a few more cards for you guys for your love energies what else do we have here about your person sagittarius what else do we have here about your person sagittarius so your person holds your heart but you know they are prideful i wouldn't say prideful but like prideful but also this person is they have a lot of head weight. They're just like, I know this person's going to come back to me. I know that they're not going to leave. So I'm not putting an effort. I'm just viewing them from far distance. I'm just like staying away, just noticing them. I don't mind what's going to happen. Let them come to me first. So this is how this person feels about you. They have a lot of head weight. With the Ace of Swords, I feel like this person views you as somebody who is going to stick around who is going to be with them but they know that they're the queen they know that they're the king so they're just waiting for you to make the first move with the six of wands in reverse position so this person being like that and i feel like they are also changing they are the mind of this person is changing to come towards you let me pick up two more cards to clarify the full card why do we have the full card in your love situation okay so this person definitely wants to move ahead with you and with a full card, yes, the renewal, the relationship has renewed. Okay, so this person's waiting for the right time for your relationship to become renewed as so that they can like actually come towards you with a whole lot of different personality. Okay, so they don't want to be like this anymore. The person with a lot of head weight and a lot of prideful behavior they don't want to be like this instead they want to change with the death card they definitely want to change and they want to come towards you they might come towards you as a fool but you might like that energy Sagittarius so yes um, this is all I can see here see you all next week Sagittarius bye